Once you enter the Organ Pipe Cactus National Monument, you'll see signs that say this. Smuggling and illegal immigration may be encountered in this area. Many parts of the 517 square mile park were closed for a decade until late 2014. That's because in 2002, Ranger Chris Egel was killed after a deadly encounter with cartel members. But despite the warnings, the park is open completely and officials say it's now safe. Arizona and Mexico share a 389 mile long border. President Donald Trump vowing to protect every single mile with a new border wall. His comments after signing the executive order to build the wall. A nation without borders is not a nation. Beginning today, the United States of America gets back control of its borders, gets back its borders. In Arizona, terrain factors into border security. Some parts of the border have tall fences, others have vehicle barriers, some with barbed wire, others with nothing. But that's not the case at Oregon Pipe. As it stands right now, there is 30 miles of fencing separating the park and America on this side from Mexico on this side. The fences, more border patrol agents, and more park rangers, some of the reasons why officials say it's now a safe place to visit. So how would a border wall change things? Would it replace what they have in place now? The National Park Service gave me this statement, saying, quote, The National Park Service has not received guidance or instruction relating to the construction of a wall along the southwest border, end quote. So, until they receive a directive from the federal government, these fences will remain as the barrier between Mexico and the United States. Reporting from the Oregon Pipe Cactus National Monument, Max Darrow, KGUN 9, on your side.